Hi loves, it's Emmeline. So today I'm gonna show you how to make four different drinks for the fall and winter time. I always find myself wanting something hot to drink and I want something different besides coffee or hot chocolate or tea. So I decided to go on Pinterest and find a few new ideas and share them with you guys as well as try them out. As you guys can tell, I'm sick and I've pretty much lost my voice. Um, but I wanted to make this video. I thought it was also a good sick day video to make because I get to drink lots of warm things. So if you guys want to see how to make these drinks, then just keep watching. I'm gonna try to do as minimal talking as possible, but I wanted to try these for you guys um, so you could see like my reaction, how they actually taste. So let's try this one. It looks delicious. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I think I'm gonna keep making this like every day because it's so good. I cannot wait to try the rest of them. I'm really excited to try this one. The recipe did say to add coffee to it, but I decided not to. If you want to add the coffee, it's an extra half a cup. But I wanted a non-coffee drink for those of you guys who don't drink coffee. So let's give it a try. I think it looks adorable and it literally looks like a red velvet cupcake, like the cupcake and the frosting. So let's see how it tastes. It's so good. So this is the one I'm the most excited for. I want to put on like a French movie or something with Audrey Hepburn and drink this. So let's see how this one tastes. Oh my gosh. So what I've heard about French hot chocolate is that it's more like a dessert because it's like, it's pretty thick and very sweet. 
and that's exactly how this is but it's so creamy and so good i don't know if i'd be able to drink this whole thing but it's really really good I'm the most excited. Ooh, my voice actually sounds a little bit better. Maybe like all these hot drinks are helping. I'm the most excited for this one. I just made like a boxed um, gingerbread man thing. I didn't have a gingerbread cookie cutter, so I had to like shape it with a knife. But let's see how the hot chocolate tastes. It tastes exactly like your gingerbread cookie, but also hot chocolate, and it tastes really good together. I didn't think it would taste good, like the thought of gingerbread and hot chocolate mixed together just sounded really gross, honestly, but it tastes so good. Wow, this is really, really good. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Because my voice is just like so annoying to listen to right now, um, I'm not going to do a devotional at the end of this video, but I will put a scripture verse. But if you guys have any um, like topics you want me to talk about at the end of my videos, then just leave them down below because I really want to like do topics that um, would in, like help you guys or inspire you guys or make you feel better um, and just kind of give you like my two cents on them. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you do try out any of the recipes, be sure to tag me in your Instagram post. Um, but I love you guys, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!